Well, Frank just said that if, instead of having stop and frisk, there were just a more automatic way, if you, you know, you could detect people with guns, that would be less sort of invasive to personal autonomy. Do you have that technology well, coming no, along? Well, no, funny you should ask, though. We are That's looking at something. We and we've been looking at it for uh, several years, but working with the Metropolitan Police and DARPA, the federal government uh, in, in DOD uh, research uh, component. It's called terahertz technology. And what it does in, a, in essence, everybody emits terahertz radiation. And what it does do is enable you to see someone, say, carrying a, a weapon. The problem is, so far, the device that has been developed is too big and it, it doesn't have the, the range. But we know what cell phones were like in, in 1986. You look what they're like now. So we, you know, we believe that the technology will only get, uh, get better. And that would be a major breakthrough as far as finding weapons on the street. Can you imagine 10 years from now that technology being deployed around the city? So just like you have cameras recording where people go, you could record you could notice that somebody with a gun is moving in a certain neighborhood? Not without a major fight. <laughs> I think the legal, you know, we, we're talking, our lawyers are looking at it, uh, you know, the issues of, obviously, Fourth Amendment uh, issues are uh, involved there. But, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is something you do in, in increments. And uh, I, I don't know if 10 years from now you'd see them, you know, positioned all over. We have to develop the, uh, the technology, and I think they would be, Concerns raised by uh, by when you have privacy, privacy concerns down in Lower Manhattan, you actually have privacy advocates sitting with you. How do you do that? Do you have in your department sort of uh, specialists in privacy and ethics issues that you discuss? With? No, we don't have we don't have privacy yeah. advocates sitting down there. Yeah. But we do have attorneys that uh, focus on this. The the protocol that I mentioned was put together by our uh, attorneys. So obviously we, you know, we live in the most litigious city in the world. So we have to be very aware of uh, potential uh, litigation and ongoing uh, litigation, and certainly uh, privacy, privacy issues are, are among them.